here's the thing I put together. There's a mechanism and the star cross there, which can be demonstrated working. Limited to the film capacity of 1895. An original 1895 or period um, lamp house. couple of switches here. This is actually a Robert Paul London variable resistance um, capacitor shunt of some kind. Don't really know but I thought that looked good there. That's the original piece. And then inside the lamp house supposedly is the arc lamp which would be controlled from the back originally. On the other side is the drive wheel. Which drives the mechanism here. Film falls into a basket, which is what Robert Paul said happened. They hadn't developed the take-up system in sort of October 95. So it, it comes down the chute into the basket. Um, I'll just show you the modern light source in there, but I think this will give you an idea. I think that's where he would have got to at that time. He wouldn't have the cast pedestal, which of course would have been made for the commercial model. And he wouldn't have the cast drive wheel. That's a sewing machine drive, which is what he would have used at the time probably in the workshop. Um, I've made that cowl for the top to look like it's the actrograph that exists, one of them. Inside the lamp house is a modern LED unit providing lots of light. And the noise that you can hear is the fan for that. And it is a little noisy. Now of course, originally when the projector was working with the arc lamp there would have been a hiss, similar sound actually from from the arc lamp. I'll just switch the lamp on the side so you can see what happens. So this is with the uh, modern light source switched on. And there is actually a picture on the screen. Workers leaving the factory, Lumiere, 1895. See it's creeping on the screen there. That's because I need my other hand to put the tension on the gate, which I can't do when I'm videoing, but it kind of works a little bit, just enough to give an indication, actually a very close indication, I think, of what Robert Paul would have achieved in his workshop in about October, knowing he was going to succeed, but still having lots of uh, little problems to iron out. <laughs> 